Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Our travels have taken us to the south of France. We're at the Orange Vélodrome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It's France against Italy. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Kylian Mbappe plays with Kingsley Coman in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. On well, attacking possibilities. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Great effort to keep that one in play. Is it going to be? Well, threat about it. Verratti. And he takes it on. Superb block. They're really pressing their opponents. And he's made headway. And a goal. An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Oh, managing to beat him. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. And to add insult to injury, it's a booking, Stuart. Well, I agree with the penalty. I'm not quite so sure about the yellow card, though. And now to level the game. And a timely penalty save. Konate. And he clears the danger. Had a chance to whip it in here. Griezmann! And a good take under duress there. What a shocking pass, really. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Come on! And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, as you see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the play he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. Back underway, level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Barella. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Barella. Can they find a gap in the defence? Keeper did his job to begin with. Finally gathered by the keeper. Well, that's a really good recovery. He had to be smart there. Barella. Putting his body on the line. 
Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Verratti. Tremendously strong in the tackle. He's got to score! And a really good diving stop. So the corner played into the box. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Counter-attacking very much an option. Not giving their opponents a moment's peace. And saved by the keeper. And over the last 15 minutes, Italy have really started to take control, haven't they? They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Good technique displayed. Defended well. And no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. France being afforded too much space here. Has a go. Well, that is going to go down as an own goal by the keeper. Well, here it is again, and quite clearly, that's an own goal. He's a bit unfortunate, really. The ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Domenico Berardi. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Well, a good tackle. You've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. And that will be a corner. So half an hour remaining. Really good interception. And he's broken free. Keeper's hand does the trick. <laughs> Kylian Mbappe. <laughs> Teo Hernandez. <laughs> Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. <laughs> and he read it well, intercepting it. <laughs> Verratti. Barella must be oh a smart stop and the substitution will occur now who's going to get on the end of it well it all counts for naught unable to keep the ball that time can they do something positive on the counter attack over the touchline for what will be a France throw. Rabiot. And making the run to the inside. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Well read to ease the pressure. Jorginho. And Politano with it. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Oh, a glorious 
saved by the keeper. And nothing wrong with that free kick either. And time for the change now. Delivering it. And the keeper takes the ball, but the main thing is he held on to it. Kono Muani. Now Rabio. Mbappe. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Domenico Berardi. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Well, it could be on for him here. And not cleared away properly. And you don't want to lose possession there. Real chance. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Well, a fierce effort, but quite simply not accurate enough. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and shots. And so the...